Let me ask you if I can about gas prices. The president was asked about that. A lot of Americans have been concerned about the cost to go to the pump these days. He said, I don't see anything that's going to happen in the meantime that's going to significantly reduce gas prices. He said, I don't have a near-term answer. For Americans who are looking for an answer, what is the answer? Well, what is true, and I think the president, as we, as I said earlier, was quite candid last night, as the American people should express from him, uh, expect from him, and from any president. Um, and there are limitations to what any president can do as it relates to gas prices. Here's what we have been doing. As we've said for some time, we are engaging broadly with OPEC uh, on our concerns at a range of levels. Um, and that is something we will continue to do. As you know, Jake Sullivan, our national security advisor, recently met with leaders in Saudi Arabia and certainly raised this issue. The president has also been concerned, as the administration has been, about what we have seen as uh, rises in supply that have not been accompanied by drops in cost. That's one of the reasons he's asked the FTC to look into price gouging, something that is no doubt impacting or we expect might be impacting the cost of gas around the country. So we are working and using every single lever he can, but I think what people heard from him is some candor about what impacts we can have. He amused that he could go into the Strategic Petroleum Reserve and that could bring the cost down. He said it would still be above $3. Will he do that? I don't have anything to preview on that front at this point. 